she's not really playing really fast. And after all, we learn Epicus. We don't use this anymore. We use our imagination to calculate everything. Oh my god. And first of all, I want to introduce what do you need when you do Epicus. You need to be really focused and concentrate on the Epicus. If you don't concentrate on the numbers and how you calculate it, it will be in a mess and you need to do it again and again. And then it's visualization. After um, you are really familiar with the abacus, you will you don't need to use the abacus anymore. You need to visualize those beats on your mind so that you can calculate it really well. And then it's practice. You need a lot of practice to make it perfect and make it make it faster and faster. So first of all, I want to introduce three kinds of abacus. The first is hexadecimal. <laughs> Anyone knows this? Um, okay. I mean, I, I might know because I know it's from China. Yeah. Instead of other country, but I know different places have different abacus. Yeah, have different abacus, and this kind of abacus is using to calculate weight because our weight, our uh, ways of counting weight is different from. Uh, kilograms or pounds, something like that. We have our own different kind of uh, ways to counting weight. So this is uh, used before in China, but now uh, we usually use this one, the Japanese one, the decimal one. And the third kind of abacus, look at here, is the Russia's one. There are 10 beads on each kind of columns. So you can count that one, two, three, four, five. But this is not efficient. We think that Japanese ones is efficient. And the reason why we're and later I will go to tell you. And nowadays we use this kind of abacus. And do you see um, there's something right here? This is for the mechanical one. Uh, uh, when you are doing abacus, it, it might be like this in a mess. And so we do like this into the two holes and separate the beads into two sides so that we can calculate. And this kind of mechanical ones will, if you touch the button, all of the beads will go uh, in the other side of the, this one now. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. Oh, sorry. <laughs> and then I'm going to introduce uh, how do we do advocates. First of all, I'm going to give you some brief uh, concept of abacus. We all know that uh, when we are little, we count things like this. One, two, three, four, five, right? Mm -hmm. So five plus two, it, it means we give two to the, to the beast. So there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And if we want minus three, we get three off, so there's four, right? And there's seven. And now we are going to use another way that we use in advocates. We take five of the beads away and use one to represent five. So this is five, six, seven. Can, can anyone get it? Yeah. And if you get three of the ones, so this is how many? Ten, Ten right? Mm -hmm. So we can use another red to represent. But uh, we don't use the red. We use another column to represent ten. Let uh, please take out your handouts. All right. This I think I think this will be a graded activity. And um, please read the question two. Um, how can I read the numbers on the abacus? There is a rod between one piece. This is a rod. This, this line is a rod. There is one. Uh, there is a rod between one beat and four beat. This one beat represents five, and these each represent one. So, um, this is how many? Six. No, uh, five is on the upper side, so it's oh. zero. Oh. This yeah. is zero. All of the beats is on the other side. We call it zero. 
And if the beat comes close to the rock, this is one, and then two, and three, four. How do we get five? We get one to five, but there's only four beats on this rod, right? So we put four down and put five here. Oh. And then we get one, six, seven, eight, nine. How about we get it more of uh, one unit? We put the other one down. We put all things down and put it right here, ten. So this is the ones column, and this is the tens column, and a hundred columns, and a thousand columns. It really makes you think. So anyone got it? Yeah. Okay, so now we're going to do some activities. First of all, one plus three, how many? Use your avocado, not, not your mind. Practice. Say the outfits. One. And then I plus three up, right? So it's four. So it, it is really easy to learn. But if you want to be really advanced, it's quite difficult. You need much more practice. And two plus three. Can anyone use Abacus to show me? Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. So anyone wants to come up and demonstrate for me? Oh. Yeah, two plus three. The answer or just the question? Uh, use the progress. You get two beats on. And then plus three. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Get her. Get her. Mm -hmm. And uh, these are really easy, right? Yeah. So. Can they have practice in that one first? Which one? Very quickly with those, some of those. Uh, Let them do five plus three. Eight plus two. Eight plus two. Right. Okay. Uh, okay, you go. Did anyone have a chance to use advertising? Did you get? Uh, eight I got it. Five. Yeah. 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 Let me do it. A two more? No. Really? No. 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 Push this. Push you can see this is one, but there's not, there's no other one, so you need to keep all that down, down, push that up, and, push and then down. give it one. Okay. And this is ten columns, so it represents ten. Okay. Yeah. Oh. You want to do it one more time, there's one more. Women, did you get it? No. Oh, I did get it. Anyone wants to try? Yeah. Okay. Alright, Gabby, this time, Tom, can you think? And and talk at the same time. You know. Okay, so you have five, six, seven, eight, nine, right? Yeah. And then you put these down. Push them. Push them. Push them. Push them. Push them. No, 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 no. Three. 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 Two, 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 two. two. <laughs> As you can see right here, here is nine. If you want to give one to these, it will become ten. So you give it one, so it's ten. ten. And you need two more because three, and you just gave them one. So you give two. Oh. So it's twelve. Anyone got it? <laughs> <laughs> Did you get it? 
Did you get it? Well, that is before. Yeah, I know it kind of. Like two year old. Four. Minus one. Ah. Uh, four. <laughs> That's too four. much more than you hope on. Sam, let's go a little bit slower because others are not getting it yet. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's the way all the other Americans. Okay, first of all, there are four beats <laughs> by four units. <laughs> Take two. And then you take two out of it. So you put yeah, it down. Yeah. So it's two, right? Yeah. And then there's five, right? Mm -hmm. And you want to take three away. So you take one first and take four out. And then there's only there's two remaining, so you take two away. So it's two. Anyone didn't know it? Yeah, I do, I need, do I need to speak it again? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. First of all, there's five, right? Yeah. One, two, three, four, five. Um, you take one first. You take one away first. So it will become four. Take one away first. It will become four. But there's three, you need to minus three. You just minus one. So there's two remaining. So you take two away. So it became two. Yeah. Okay. I'm not bring this to test. And then it's eight. Eight minus two. So anyone wants to try? Sorry. Uh, Anyone wants to try? Step by step. How do you do minus two? Just take two off. Just take two off, right? So it's five, six, right? Yay. Yeah, we'll do a really big one. Yeah, yeah. Like, like 19,000. All right, do, like, do the 14. Let them do the 14. Four five. Oh, yeah. Oh, because there is just. It's just a little numbers, but uh, you need to do it uh, in one plus one. Oh. Yeah, anyone wants to try? Wait, what? what? This is a combination of minus and plus. But uh, as we do it did before, it, there's just uh, one plus one or two, uh, one minus one. But here is there are four things you need to calculate. So is that? So two, this is two plus nine plus, plus six, six minus, minus one. one. Anyone want to try this one? Can you multiply? Yeah, but... Oh, Bob. 